tablets. This holiday season, the newest tablets will be a top gift item. And just in time for Black Friday, our partners at Consumer Reports magazine have just released their ratings of tablets, finding the best and the worst. Shopping for a tablet? Apple's newest, the iPad Air, has been getting plenty of attention. Our partners at Consumer Reports magazine just tested it and gave it top ratings. Weighing in at just a pound and with a slender profile, the iPad Air is the lightest full size tablet ever. That makes it great for reading or watching movies. Even though Apple made the iPad Air thinner and lighter, they didn't sacrifice screen quality at all. This screen looks just as good as the screen on the iPad 4. The iPad Air earned Consumer Reports highest score for any tablet ever. 4G starts at $629. It's $500 for Wi-Fi only. If you prefer an Android tablet, Consumer Reports recommends the newest Samsung Galaxy Note, $550. What's unique about it is that it comes with a stylus and a set of apps that work specifically with that stylus. The stylus is pretty advanced and it allows you to do things like write notes within an app or draw graphics. Too pricey for your budget? Consumer Reports recommends the 7-inch Kindle Fire HDX at just $230. The magazine's worst tablet tested? The Monster M7 sold at Walmart for $150. Three different versions of it froze up for testers, so Consumer Reports has slapped it with a don't buy. Consumer Reports also tested the new iPad Mini and says it's even better than the previous version, even has a longer-lasting battery. Finally.